Before I say anything, I want you to watch this clip of a Somali vlogger in India. Nice meal. Yeah. Very nice. Oh. Really, really good. Uh, Somalia. 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 Oh, very, very dangerous country. <laughs> no, no, so much. Not so much. Uh, just how? Hmm? Nothing. I. This is uh. I hear that Somalia is very dangerous. Not really. Water thieves. Real pirates of Caribbean in Somalia. It's not too bad. No, no, no anymore. No anymore. Because all the all the boats they sort of stopped coming through the waters. Now the government is strict. Yeah, you could say that. Yeah, yeah, you could say that. It's much better. Much better. Much better. Much better yeah. I don't know what you're saying. Do you want black, black? Um, I don't understand. Worms, like worms, small, small worms in the... Worms in my hair? Yeah, no. there is not worms in your hair. No, I don't know what you're saying. Okay. Okay, just relax. I'm, I like, you look good in this. You go What's inside that? the washroom and Changitra bathing. No, no. Wait. My brother is also has a curly hair. I enjoy my meal. In Somalia? Yeah, why not? Oh, yes. Your Negro? Am I what? Mother of Negro means uh, uh, Negro peoples in the African, yeah, we call them Negro peoples. Uh, I'll give you one advice. Yes. Jinga la la hoo hoo. If you, if you ever say... He was eating his food and not bothering anybody, but they decided to join him as you saw. And they said the most horrible things like, how do you come up with so many offensive things within just a few minutes and I saw some people arguing on their behalf and these are black people by the way saying that they don't mean no harm they just not educated they were not articulating themselves very well you don't need to be educated to have humanity you don't need to be even children should know that you don't go to another person and tell them that it looks like they have worms in their hair because he has curly hair go wash yourself how do you give an excuse for this kind of treatment i just couldn't understand and they called him the n-word they even stated that the people in america we that's what we call them the n-word how are you making an excuse for this kind of behavior and what they said to this man is clearly not right and clearly was not a conversation that should have happened with a stranger if you're a stranger you ask questions if you want to understand about a different culture the first thing they told him when he told them that he's from Somalia is that oh that's a dangerous country the pirates how do you justify this I just don't understand but that's what some not some but like two people that were making an argument and standing up for this man said and I don't know their profile picture was black I don't know if they're trolls, but it was just shocking to read that, right? But what I found amazing about this video is the young man. He was composed, he had patience, and you can see at the end he was starting to get a little bit um, annoyed, but he still kept it cool because at the end of the day, he's in their country, in their territory, and there's many of them. Like, I felt uncomfortable for him because even if he wanted to stand up for himself he's gonna put himself in danger it was a dangerous situation I'm glad he was able to get out of it I tried to look for his name I couldn't find it if you have any information about him please comment down below but this brother really kept his cool and he was patient which is admirable considering the situation he was in and where he's at he needed to be careful but how horrible this man probably went to india or that specific area to explore to see the world and this is the treatment he gets it's just unfair anyways fam let us know down below what your thoughts are about this video i am on gilzala la the next one